hey what's up everybody hope you guys are doing great welcome back to our video tutorial series for beginners on how to create amazing ai chatbots in this video we're gonna focus on the analytics page of our chatbot builder account this is a page i know many of us don't even look at but i highly recommend that every now and then or maybe once a month we take a few minutes to look at this page because it has very useful information uh, and it let us know how well our bot is performing all right it gives us a medical report on how healthy our bot is all right so in this video we're gonna look at a few things there's quite a lot of information in here we're not gonna cover every single thing some many of them are self-explanatory uh, but we will just take some time to look at a few things and what they mean all right um, on the left hand side there is a master menu right here that takes us to different part of our account uh, if you look at the top right here you notice there are some boxes here uh, that represents the channels that we are connected to right so anytime let me go over to settings uh, let me go to channels anytime you connect to any one of these channels right here uh, a box will show up here to represent the channel you've connected to all right um, over here we have some kind of a filter system that allows you to look at reports based on a specific period of time right so if we want to look at this month or if we want to look at last 30 days something like that we can look at what's going on all right uh, over to the left hand side you have the total number of contacts uh, over here we got uh, the number of new contacts these are contacts that have reached out to us maybe within the past 24 to 48 hours right and then we have our active contacts these are those that have interacted or uh, you know sent some messages during the past 48 hours right so they could be new they could be old contacts it don't matter as long as they are active all right uh, to the right hand side uh, we have response time and as you can see the response time is zero minutes zero seconds this is what we want to see okay anytime your response time minutes start going up 10 minutes 15 20 minutes then it's showing that you are entering a territory that's bad right uh, it's showing it's taking longer for you to respond to your users uh, messages we don't want that so we want the response time to be close to zero as much as possible right to the right side of it we have first response time this is the uh, this one is showing how fast we respond to users that interact with our bot for the very first time okay so the one to the left don't matter whether it's a first time or an old customer but the one to the right focuses on those who interact uh, with our bot on for the very first time okay so we also want that to be close to zero as much as possible it shows that we are responding really fast okay and then we have some graphs over here all right that helps us to understand um, you know what's going on uh, in case there are some things that you don't understand here no worries there are different ways you can um, get answers to it all right if you notice on top of some of these charts there are something called like a tooltip you could just hover your mouse over here and you can see that black bar it gives you explanation of what's going on here okay you can see that and then there's another useful tool to the right side of the page okay it's this kind of a, a widget all right it says help me right here just go ahead and click it and this widget right here it's sort of like a chat widget but it's connected to chatbot builders ai support and it does a very good job okay i tested it out and it does a really good job right so for example if there's something you don't understand in here let's say you don't understand the difference between new contacts and active contacts so you can just write it in here what's the difference 
between new contacts and active contacts on the analytics dashboard all right so you can just ask the AI support to help you out and let's see what it gives us it does a really good job though see how it it breaks it down look at that so it says the new contacts the metrics tracks the number of unique users who have initiated a conversation with the chatbot for the first time within a specific time frame okay uh, it doesn't really give you the time frame like I said it could be maybe 48 hours 24 hours uh, new contacts indicate the growth of your chatbot user base and the acquisition of new users interacting with the chatbot for the first time and then here it says active contacts refer to the number of unique users who have engaged with the chatbot within the defined time period including both new and returning users exactly all right so you can see this tool is very helpful okay so it's saying that the active contacts don't really take into if uh, you know account whether it's a new person or it's an old person as long as they engage they become active right but the new contact focuses more on the first time uh, you know users who interact with your bot all right so guys this tool is super helpful I've tested it and I highly recommend if for any reason you don't understand anything here just type it in here it's AI powered and it does a really really good job okay so there are some more stuff in here I don't want to spend too much time on this because there is a beautiful tool that helps you and it breaks everything down for you and I think you guys are smart enough to you know engage with this with this AI support right uh, and of course if none of these work you can always reach out to chatbot builders support team they do a really good job they are always available to help you out if you don't understand anything all right like I said guys take some time and um, you know take a look at this page at least once a month it will help you understand what's going on with your bot it will help you see if there are some changes that need to be made you know it will give you a good analysis of how well your bot is performing all right thank you guys for watching this video i'll see you all in the next video don't forget to subscribe to this channel hit the notification bell so anytime i post a new video you get an alert all right thanks for watching and have a good day bye